Okay, guys, this is Isaiah chapter 65, verses 1 through 9. Uh, here we see God is very mad. He is heated because there are a bunch of heathens that are worshipping the hosts, which are the angels, and just doing a whole bunch of sinful things before him. And he's just really mad about it. And I was like, man, I'm just going to share this with you guys. This is this is some intense stuff right here. Okay, that's that's an understatement. Because we're talking about the Lord. All right. I am sought of them that ask not for me. I am found of them that sought me not. I said, Behold me, behold me unto a nation that was not called by my name. I have spread out my hands all the day unto a rebellious people which walketh in a way that was not good after their own thoughts. A people that provoked me to anger continually to my face, that sacrifice it in gardens and burn it incense upon altars of brick which remain among the graves, and lodge in the monuments, which eat swine's flesh and broth of abominable things, is in their vessels, which say, Stand by thyself, come not near me, for I am holier than thou. These are a smoke in my nose, a fire that burneth all day. Behold, it is written before me, I will not keep silence, but will recompense, even recompense into their bosom. Your iniquities and the iniquities of your fathers together, saith the Lord, which have burned incense upon the mountains, and blasphemed me upon the hills. Therefore I will measure their former work in their bosom. Thus saith the Lord, as the new wine is found in the cluster, and one saith, Destroy it not, for a blessing is in it. So will I do for my servants' sake, that I may not destroy them all. And I will bring forth the seed out of Jacob and out of Judah, an inheritor of my mountains, and mine elect shall inherit it, and mine servants shall dwell there. You see, the Lord says he will bring a seed out of Jacob and out of Judah. All right? The Lord loves Israel, man. Even though they're, you know, turning their backs on his son and everything like that, he still continues to love y'all. I'm going to get more scripture on this just throughout the week. More scripture on how the Lord just continues to put up with just blatant, uh, rampant sin. Uh, Jewish people, people of Israel, you have the most powerful being in the universe, in existence, on your side. And he is waiting on you. Okay? So, that being said, guys, I think uh, that'll be all for today. So yeah, I'm signing off.